the work we do in what's called the Refugee Economies Programme in Oxford is not just top-down research from an outsider perspective. It tries to work with the community so that if we're going to work with people, if we're going to try and build an economy, we understand that economy from the perspective of the people who it affects. The education of marginalised girls uh, may be one of the highest return of investment available right now in refugee camp, marginalised communities, slums. So we've been working with the girls across the camp uh, and they've been learning how to code. This is the first time in history young girls from Kakuma refugee camp are being mentored by Salesforce. When we are healthy, we can work. When we can work, we can gain and we can also have a sustainable life. Entrepreneurs perform better when they have adequate support. Entrepreneurship training, we found, makes a difference. We can learn from it and hopefully improve the way the outside world engages with the community in Kakuma. At the community level, we've been doing door-to-door -door household visits um, to figure out how many people have symptoms of COVID-19, including fever, cough, and so forth. We're also looking at health behaviors. Are, are people washing their hands? Um, are they going out in public? Are they wear, wearing face masks? I started making masks when I saw the people was dying, and the only way to save my community is to make face masks for them so that they can protect themselves. What I need now is to grow my business and also working with the community so that I can help even young, young people in the camp who don't have a work. Many financial management trainings and other financial in inclusions, that is for business expansion. This population are greatly talented. They have ideas, they have skills. They have documents, they have knowledge, they have skills, they have talents of which if it is globally supported, it can be taken to you know a different level of their life and they can be more resilient than anybody else. What Kasidab does is to bring on governance side the Kenyan central government, who is the host for the refugees, the, the county government of Kakuma County in northern Kenya, and uh, UNHCR and the refugees together to, to see how we can govern a, a social economic plan for the whole region. Refugees should not be overlooked as an incredible pool of talent just because of you know, where they happen to live or the situations that they've been born into.